shoes maketh a man. At least that's what's fueling the work in this shop in Yola. It opened about 20 years ago, aiming to take destitute young men off the streets by teaching them a craft. Then the Boko Haram insurgency broke out. The insurgents, a lot of business crippled. But some people are trying to bring up themselves very well. And uh, the economy will not build itself. It's actually we that will build the economy. Even if insurgents have affected and destroyed the economy, we will still be the ones to build it. And how are we going to build it? By getting one or two jobs done. The brainchild of Joshua Samuel, the store isn't bringing in as much as it used to before the insurgency. But Joshua says business is slowly starting to increase again. The business is speaking because as when I come here during insurgency, people have no work doing. And when they when they start coming, they are patronizing us. They say this your shoe is good. Then from there, business is speaking small, small. A pair of shoes sells for between four and eight dollars, an affordable price for residents looking to take advantage of cheaper, locally made products. We have tried some of the shoes at the at the at the showroom, and compare the price. That one is higher, and it can't last long, like the one that he usually made with his hand. So I believe on local products; they last longer. The insurgency may have taken away a lot from Nigerians, but it hasn't dented Joshua's passion. Along with his apprentices, Joshua is planning to help Nigeria's economy recover one step at a time. Leslie Marungu, CGTN.